Okay. That's creepy. It says hurt. What the hell? Oh, is there anybody out there? Somebody out there? Brad! Brad! I don't know where he is. Why does it sound like he's like back there? I don't think there is a way back there. What's up guys, welcome back to a brand new Randonautica adventure. I know there's some people screaming in the background. So I'm actually back to a place that I was at last week and I decided to bring some backup. We got Brad with us. Um, he decided to come out today and we are doing some Randonautica. We are back at the place I was at last week where I encountered some random person here in the woods. I didn't even oh, tell you what happened, yeah. did I? No, no. Um, yeah, I was getting chased by somebody with a taser as far as i know oh my god I, I mean we could hear it i didn't see them or the you know the taser but they were definitely out there we can we could hear it clearly so um we actually just ran two points uh it looks like our two points are on different paths but we should have enough daylight to kind of survive for yeah, the time being time. yeah so um brad is gonna go one way his looks like it's going through the cavern type of thing mine looks like it's kind of going around for some odd reason so i'm gonna head that way uh, i did use an intent from Spirit Believer 2020, hide and seek. So hopefully this does not turn into a hide and seek. Don't hide from me, okay? Or otherwise I'm gonna win the hide and seek game. But uh, yeah, smash the like button, let's get on in there and uh, let's figure out what uh, what the hell is going on in this place. Alrighty, so um, it looks like Brad's point is like down here somewhere and mine is like around here. So I gotta go this way, he's gonna go that way and i don't know i guess i can go all the way around and we'll meet at the uh the building thingies so um yeah i guess we'll see you in a little bit all right oh the nice thing is we still have some daylight so it's not too bad um yeah i'm gonna probably be bouncing back and forth between randonautica and some haunted stuff just to keep it interesting oh look a giant rock <laughs> um so it is pretty buggy I literally just absolutely doused myself in deet. Oh, look at this. There's more of these things down here. That is so cool. Oh. Okay. Um, yeah, it looks like I got quite a bit of a hike to get through before we get to our destination. And then we're pretty much going to loop around. At least that's what it looks like on the map. Um, I've never gone this way, so I don't really know what to expect, to be honest. I'm just kind of glad that it's warm and we still got some daylight but I did bring all of my lights just in case because at the end we might just need them I don't I don't know <laughs> yeah all right and of course this place is Bruce Trail <laughs> because as all of you guys know Bruce is just literally all over the place um, he is endless <laughs> he just goes on forever and ever and ever <laughs> okie dokie nice i don't know if there's like any actual caverns or things we have to climb down on this side it kind of looks that way what's up with these things looks like some uh sod things that they decide to plant stuff through i have no idea that's interesting So last time we were here, um, we definitely know that there was someone out here and I kind of wanted to come back just to see what the heck was going on here. What the hell that deal, what the hell that guy's deal was all about. Not sure why somebody would be secretly hiding in a place like this. Um, and then come after people with, you know, weapons, essentially weapons of mass destruction that produce electricity which is obviously a joke <laughs> there's something moving probably just an animal at least that's what i like to tell myself so i just heard like the loudest scream but 
there are families with children down there and I think they were doing like a baseball practice or a game or something. A bunch of little girls and uh, I think the kids are just screaming but I don't know. Sometimes uh, you gotta wonder. Um, I feel kind of bad. Maybe me and Brad probably shouldn't have separated <laughs> just in case but um, what the hell is that? There's like a little thing over here. Thank you for celebrating with us. Uh, what does it say? Randeep and Patricia. May 13, 2023. It's like a little bronze elephant. I think it might be like a candle holder or something. Well, that's interesting. Okay. Cool. Actually, maybe I'll just hang on to that and put it at the front. Oh, I just noticed it has like a little carpet. That's kind of cool, actually. Um, okay. <laughs> That's really random. Uh, so it begins? I mean, I'm not gonna lie, I find the weirdest shit sometimes. Also, there's like this black thing down there. I'm just gonna shove this in the side pocket of my uh, backpack for now. I don't know what that is. That's just a tree stump, or I got no idea. What the hell? <laughs> what is that? It's like a colorful thing in there. Brad? Okay. We got a flask to go, and it has something in it. I mean, to be honest with you, I wouldn't be surprised if there's, like, booze or something in it. It's, uh, very squishy. I'm starting to really hate seeing all this garbage everywhere <laughs> in the damn forest. Um, let me see if I can open this thing. I don't know how I'm gonna manage this with just one hand. Oh, oh might have gotten it. Ooh. Ooh, boy. Ooh, that's definitely booze. Okay, we're just gonna <laughs> put that one back. Because uh, you can keep your freaking booze, but we will uh, keep going. So I'm still like really, really far. Oh, there's another one. This one appears to be empty. Okay. Hello? Really hoping that uh, that person's not here. Cause that was pretty uh, pretty freaky last time. Not gonna lie. Man, the sun is going down so early today. What's going on here? Oh hey, it's another one of those fish. Oh, okay. Uh, why? Okay, uh, that was weird. My camera decided it wanted to stop filming for some reason. Um, I don't understand, like, who's putting all these fish everywhere. Is there any more? I found the same thing, but, like, towards the cavern area last time, so I don't really know. And it uh, looks like I can confirm that the dark things that I was looking at are just trees. <laughs> just dark tree stumps and logs and whatnot. Okay, I don't know if there's actually going to be anything interesting along this trail at all. It literally just looks like... Just a trail. <laughs> I think Brad got a little lucky and he's getting the uh, the exciting side with all the caverns and whatnot. And of course I have the long route, it looks like. Um, but it looks like I might end up coming up to what I think might be a road. I don't know if it's just a road or just a trail or whatever it might be, but... Let's move down there. I mean, based on the last couple of times 
um, that we've done this. Even the last time I was here, like I said. Okay, whatever that was, was loud. And that's like right in the forest too. Okay, interesting so far. Might have to uh, stop and put my light on in a second because it's getting real dark in here and I don't know how well the camera is seeing at the moment. Okay, I'm gonna just do that real quick. Alrighty, and we now have light. Stop for a second and put that on there so we can actually see everything clearly oh geez almost tripped <laughs> dang rock <laughs> hate how there's like random rocks that sometimes you just don't see them and you just go boop, right over okay oh looks like we're at a uh, bit of a crossroad oh. what was that where does that way go uh excuse me or excuse you? What the hell? Um. Okay. That's creepy. What the hell? There's a random Charmander shirt here. And a Squirtle. Oh, stupid bugs. Um, okay. That's uh, a bit concerning. Also those noises down there. Hello? So, yeah, apparently we're here. Um, how do we get to... So Black Creek Side Trail is showing it's this way. But I'm confused because wouldn't it have to be this way to get to my point? I'm pretty close to it, I think, but I'm also really not sure. <laughs> uh, I'm trying to figure this out. Near draw kiln, no rest areas on this trail. Okay, that's good. I keep hearing something down there. Someone out there? Also, why is there a Pokemon shirt here? Oh, that's cute. It's like some kids Pokemon. Oh, damn, almost dropped it. Yeah, it literally just says, gotta catch them all. We got uh, Pikachu, Bulbasaur, Squirtle, and Charmander. Okay. What size is this? Oh, that's something like a marking. Me. Me one? Okay. Yeah, I don't know what size this is. Uh, interesting. Okay. There's nothing else in here, is there? Weird. No, like, names or anything. Um, yeah, so I don't know why Mr. Clown-looking character... Oh! Is on the tree like that. We're just gonna put you over there. Um... I gotta figure out what to do with that knife, because that really should not be out here. Also, I want to see what the hell these noises are all about, and where this trail goes. This looks like it just goes to a dead end. Most likely the case. Oh, it actually continues on further. But it says the trail ends, so it just goes to, I don't know where that goes, maybe private property or something. Hence the fence. Okay, that's, uh interesting <laughs> uh i don't know what to do about mr clown with knife whether i should just leave him here I, I think it's probably not a good idea to leave it there um just because somebody could get injured so i might just take it and just at least shove the knife in my bag just in the event that just so no one cuts himself of course okay so i am unsure as to whether this is the right way or not but I'm just gonna head down this way anyways and kind of hope for the best um, and hope that this connects to where I'm trying to get to what the hell 
What is that? What the f it says hurt. What the hell? Someone out there? Um, why is there literally just a random envelope punctured into the tree? The f <laughs> okay. <laughs> well, this just got really weird, really fast. I don't know if there's anybody out there. Somebody out there? It's a bit concerning when the last time I came here. Ran into that weirdo. Okay, let's just be very cautious. Um, honestly, I'm a little perturbed at the moment and kind of don't want to hang around. Great, now I got another random knife. And they are pretty sharp too. Why they're stuck there in the tree, I have no idea. But okay, um... That's a little bit alarming, to say the least. I'm just gonna put this one away too, I guess. What the f no. Okay, time to uh, get a move on here. Let's see what the hell is in here exactly. Empty? Oh no, there's definitely something in here. What is that? What the hell? More than one story more than one story did i not find these here last time too tell a story about a time when something hurt why what kind of weird game is this all about what are these looks like pages from a book if you really want to hear about it, the first thing you'll probably want to know is where I was born and what my ch lousy childhood was like, whoa, and how my parents were occupied and all before they had me and all that David Copperfield kind of crap, but I don't feel like going into it. Uh -huh. Dude, this is long. What is this? There were never many girls at all at the football games. Only seniors were allowed to bring girls with them. It was a terrible school no matter how you looked at it. I like to be somewhere at least where you can. Okay. I don't know what to make of this. That is really, really weird. Um, I think we'll just hang on to it for the time being and maybe look at it later. And I don't know if it's from like a book or something, but yeah. I'll, uh, I'll just hang on to that for now. I mean, why the hell was it just on the tree like that? That's creepy. Okay, um, well, let's take this trail and hope that it actually connects to, uh, those buildings, because that's where Brad is heading. So I'm guessing this was more or less the intended point i like i get i don't even know it's telling me that this trail was where i was supposed to go if i'm not mistaken <laughs> i am very confused right now because the way the the map is drawn just doesn't really make much sense unless i'm just misinterpreting it which is possible just you know in my usual dumbass routine but okay Let's see if we find anything else that's kind of Tells us what the hell is going on in here. Definitely quite concerning that there are a bunch of knives lying around. Random inanimate objects stabbed into trees. Okay, and I also heard something down there. Sound kind of like a loud thump. Whoa. Now this looks like another trail. What the heck? 
Oh, I get it now. Okay. So it wanted me to come down here, and then I gotta go around this way. So I'm here right now. Okay, that kind of makes sense. So I'm pretty sure the point was here then. So what am I looking for then? And the question is, do I continue on this way and go all the way around? It's going to take me a while because this is literally a two kilometer loop. Oh boy. <laughs> That was a very weird sound. Someone here? It sounded like there was somebody down there. Hey, uh, person I encountered last time, are you here? Okay, that is just a toad. So that's nothing. But that's not what I heard though. Shit. I think someone's in there. Hello? Taser, taser. They're here. They're definitely here. Let's just keep moving. We'll take this route. Oh, oh. What the hell? Oh. What the hell did he just say? Okay. That's a bit much. Yeah, no thanks. I ain't gonna stick around for that. Nope. <laughs> no, thank you. I really need to get my flashlight up, but I am not going to stop. Not when that guy is out here. Holy moly. Okay. Let's just go. Dude, no wonder this guy can get around. Look, there's all these like random little side trails. I think they're coming. That would hurt. Crap. Brad! Oh, crap, he's all the way on the other side. Oh, f me. Oh, f oh. What the f Oh, I can hear them. They're coming. 100% coming. Brad! Shut oh. oh my god. Oh man. I have no idea where the hell I am right now. Oh. Oh crap. Okay. Well, you just stay there. Wherever the hell you are, or whoever the hell you are. Oh. Well, this was a bad idea. Definitely a bad idea. Huh. Huh. Okay. Huh. I can hear the stream. Huh. Huh. Okay. We might be getting closer to the I think they stopped. Okay. 
Who the f this person? Jeez, man. Not cool. Not cool at all. Okay, I need to get my flashlight. Okay, I got my flashlight out. I think they might have stopped. I don't know what the hell this person's problem is, but... No doubt this person is definitely hiding out here for some odd reason. Uh, all right. Well, we got quite the trek. I'm going to keep moving as fast as I can. And uh, yeah, just got to be careful because there's a lot of things we can trip on. And don't want to hurt myself. What the hell is that? What the? Okay. What the hell is in here? What the hell is this stuff? Random stamp. Dude, what's the deal with all the stamps lately? Random pen, okay. Oh man. This shit again? Family? Um, okay. I'll just put you back in there. Looks like there's stuff written on this. Oh my god, that says my name. Also, what is that screeching? Yeah, that's like a hawk or something. That's pretty loud. Hey, Brad's okay. Okay. Um. Okay. Like, dude, you have to seriously be kidding me. So, last time I was out, I found something just like this. This one says Angela was an avid explorer and had always been intrigued by the mysterious and unknown. One fateful evening, he stumbled upon an app called Randonautica, which claimed to lead users to random and unique locations nearby. Eager to embark on a, an adventure, Angelo downloaded the app and decided to give it a try. Yeah, that was like a couple years ago. I swear I heard something. It says, Angelo invited his close friend Sarah to join him on his... Someone literally just screamed. I don't know if it was Brad. Oh, Jesus. Train. Brad? Like, I don't know what to do with this. Do I just leave this stuff here? Oh. It's down there now. You know what? I am gonna keep moving. Um, I'll read whatever the hell that is later on. Is that actually a bird or is like something out there? That's loud. Okay, I'm just gonna get a move on. I swear I just heard somebody screaming again. I hope it's not Brad. I hope he's okay. Damn. That has to be like a hawk or something, maybe even an eagle. Oh, there he is again. Okay, let's try and catch. 
catch up with Brad. I did text him, but he didn't respond. I don't know if that's a good... Well, this is not good. Um, damn. Damn mosquitoes, man. They're freaking chomping on my back. <sighs> okay. Let's just move as quickly as we can and try and get to the, uh, the furnace thing. <sighs> Hopefully I can find him. And this is going to be one long hike. Oh. Okay, someone's coming. I think it's probably that damn guy again. Oh. I'd love if there was a damn shortcut. Oh, I just saw somebody move. Yep, nope. Don't stop. What is that? I think it's just a plant. Someone's screaming. Brad! Oh. Oh. oh crap. Stay back! Stay back! Stay back! Oh you mother Too far. Oh, Brad. The only problem is he never would have taken this trail. Crap. What is this dude's problem? Stay back. I'm warning you. Oh, crap. I should probably get my knife. these people are. How the hell do they know my name? Brad! Brad? Oh, here's someone. Problem is, I don't know if that was behind me or ahead of me. Oh, That's, uh, okay. Oh, we're getting it. Crap. Oh, oh. oh just keep moving. Just keep moving. Look back. Oh. Where's this way go? I don't know where the hell I go. I think it's this way. Come on. Come on, Brad, where are you? Oh, almost fell. It's definitely not the ideal place to deal with this. Brad? Oh. 
Just thrown in the freaking water. Oh boy. Oh boy. Okay. Let's just keep going. Okay. I think I hear someone. Brad, are you here? Okay, okay, let's just calm down, collect our damn thoughts. Damn. Yeah, I don't think I'm coming back here. Holy sh**. Oh man, that's a bit much. Oh, that'll make your heart race. Holy. Brad, oh, come on, man. This trail's too long. This was a really bad idea. I know I keep saying it, but it's true. <laughs> I f***ed up. I'll own it. Uh, gotta like almost be there. I just heard something. Okay, whatever. Whatever, man. I don't know what your f problem is, but I'm warning you. I have a weapon. Sounded like whoever they were is like just over there somewhere, but I can't see them because it's damn. There's too much brush. Uh, okay, up the hill, down the hill, or down the hill, up the hill. <laughs> Come on. Just heard something over there. <sighs> heard screaming Brad Screaming down there too. What the f is going on out here? Like for real. Holy f oh man. I have literally been like hiking through here forever. Oh, this place is just endless. Ooh. Oh, I thought what is that? Is it just water? Okay, I thought it was something else. Oh, dude. This trail literally never ends. Oh. I'm just hoping that I'm going the right way. I'm pretty sure I am because I mean the marker is literally right there. Oh. It'd be pretty hard to oh, get lost in here. Whew. Oh, it's getting a little cold. What the hell? So I texted Brad again, but he's still not answering. Uh, hopefully he remembered to bring his phone. Because that would seriously suck if that was the case. 
Brad? Where are you, man? Oh, I hear something. Sounds like he's yelling. Brad? It was like right there. Oh, it sounds like I'm getting closer to the falls. Oh, oh. finally. Oh. Oh. Brad! Where is he? Brad! Uh, I stopped for a second to change battery. I heard someone coming. Oh, whoever that is, they're literally right behind me. Brad? I don't know where he is. Uh. Brad, where are you, man? Oh. Oh. oh, there's a stupid furnace thing. Damn it. Oh. Mosquito bit my leg. Brad! Oh. Where is he? Brad? Oh. Maybe he's up ahead? I don't know. I don't hear anything. Maybe he's at the uh, the other building. Brad. Oh, oh. oh. getting lots of cardio in today. That's for damn sure. Oh. Brad. What's weird is I don't hear that bird anymore. Or maybe I'm just too far away. I don't know. <sighs> Brad? <sighs> I just heard someone. It sounded like Brad. <laughs> what the hell? Oh, tell me he went missing. Oh, sh Brad? I hear someone. Brad, is that you? What the hell? Okay, was that him? Or was that an owl? Brad? Stupid frog. Why does it sound like he's like back there? I don't think there is a way back there. Brad? I don't know. I'm totally confused. I think I might just start heading back. Brad, come on, man. Where are you? Shit. Hey, he ain't here. That's not good. Not good at all. I literally just heard something. Who's there? Someone's there. Who's there? Hey, you, buddy. 
Brad? Holy f Holy Dude. Yeah, I heard a sound in the bush as soon as I picked it up, man. Yeah, there's uh someone out there. Oh yeah, I think it's the same person as last time. I don't know where the hell they are. Oh my god. I think we need to start heading back. That's all I found. I didn't want to open this by myself, like I just didn't want to mess around, but there's like letters in this thing. Oh that's weird. Yeah. Okay. Um Well Whew. time to uh Get the hell out of here. Okay. Dude, I was literally about to shank you, bro. Oh my god. Oh, so I didn't know. It was him. You thought it was him? Yeah. Oh, well, I heard something. I'm like, what the hell was that? Yeah. Oh, that's crazy. Okay. Okay. Whew. I thought I heard something down there. Oh yeah. What the hell is that? Oh, I see that too. What is that? Just be very careful. Dude, it's like a little chest. Check it out. Put this stuff aside. Freaked out that something's gonna jump out. Yeah, at me. please don't be anything dead. What the hell is that? So it looks like there's what a the bunch of and stuff in here. I mean letters. It's almost like kids stuff, right? Oh, cute things. Yeah. What the fuck? Definitely doesn't spell Wait. anything. Look at how many letters. Yeah, I know. I just saw that too. Look at. It. It's the same thing. It's the right? same thing. Hmm. And it says they're all mine now. I'm just gonna put my bag down out of the way. Yeah, like, what is this thing, bro? There's something written on it. What is that, sir? It's all taped together, like in a ball. We alone in the world? Let's see. Hopefully, we can get it open without damaging it, that's for sure. Oh, it looks like it's just pink. See? Here, hold the other side. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We'll still be able to read it. Let's get that part off here. No, 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 I heard something move over there. Okay, let's just see what this thing is. Maybe tear from this side. Yeah, let's get it open. Hold it. Whoever did this. What is this thing here? That is oh my god. It's an eagle. Cool. This says something for sure. There's something on here, guys, that they want us to see, but... Oh, I can see through the tape. Okay. It says, are we alone in the woods? Okay. Okay, that's great. Um, what else does it say? Bro? Our lives in grave... Danger. Well, that's good. Good to know. Um, you gonna shake it? <laughs> I mean, of course. Oh my god! <laughs> Literally really? says of course. That is uh, crazy. Go screw yourselves. Okay, that's fun. Um. Okay. Let's just get the. Yeah. Yeah, let's just get, uh, let's get back. <sighs> Almost. What's wild too is oh. the image on that thing. I've been coming across things without like okay. the water. Oh, I just want to get the hell out of here. This is a completely different area from where we were. <sighs> I don't know how these people follow us. Oh. <sighs>
Is this it? Oh no, that's not it. That's another, just a random spot. Okay. Yeah, we just gotta follow this rope. <coughs> oh, here we go. I think. Never have I been so glad to see a cave. Yeah. I mean, it's very beautiful, like the landscapes and surrounding. Sure, but this is the thing. Like, if a person were to chase us through this, like, we could get really injured. In Especially with all these walls around. Good. Yeah. Oh wow, this is cool. Don't be alarmed, but I'm pretty sure I just saw a bright light behind you. Or be alarmed, one or the other. Yeah. It's up to you. Okay, let's just just get in here. If that's them. Mm -hmm. <sighs> it could still be falling. Yeah. That's, that's the thing. Yeah. The lights are bright as shit. Yeah. Well, um, I say we just get the hell out of here. Okay. Ooh. Damn. I hear something. Hurry up, hurry up. Okay, okay. I just heard something back there. Who's out there? Whatever it was, was literally right there. I'm just ready to hightail it out of here. Okay. Let's go. Quick. Whew. Okay. I just saw something again. That was a very bright one. Like a flashlight? Yeah. It like strobed. I don't know. Well, we still got a ways to go, so prepare yourself. It feels like I've been running for four damn kilometers, which I pretty much have. <sighs> Thought I heard something. Well, that was just whatever fell here, but I heard something down there. I don't know, kind of, kind of just sounds like there's things everywhere at this point. <sighs> well, you don't know if there's more than one. I got no idea. And even the one that there is, who knows where the hell they even are. Yeah. Right? <sighs> you gotta think, if someone's living in whatever, yeah. they would know these birds. Oh yeah, there's like little side trails kind of all over the place that normally you're not supposed to take, but if they know this place well enough, they're gonna they're gonna take whichever route they want. 100%. Right, right there. You hear that? see anything though yeah it was like a really loud thump 
Hello, dear? Is that you? I don't know. I think we're almost there. Okay. Oh. Yeah, we're definitely almost here. We got the spaceship. Um, definitely smell something. I don't know what it is. It smells like something died. It's even worse over here. <coughs> oh man. We playing uh follow the smell. <laughs> I guess. I mean I ain't following the smell, I'm just gonna follow the trail, but it seems like the trail leads to the smell. Yeah. Possibly. Well, I heard a car door, so I think we're just about at the parking lot. Thankfully. Oh, thank you, Lord, baby Jesus. Oh, glad we made it back to the uh, parking lot. So, I found this. Um, I did not get a chance to read the whole thing because someone was out there, so I decided to leave. Um, so, where we left off is something about me inviting my close friend Sarah to join my me on my thrilling expedition. I don't have a close friend named Sarah, so that's weird. Um, they met up at Angelo's house, and with a series of anticipation and excitement, they launched the Randonautica app on their smartphones. This is really weird. Mm -hmm. Like, there's like a story written about me using Randonautica. Wow. I found two of these before. The app generated a set of coordinates promising an unusual and unexplored location for them to discover. The duo hopped in Angelo's car and set off on their journey. As they drove deeper into the night, the surroundings grew darker and more foreboding. The atmosphere, the atmosphere seemed to reflect the eerie coordinates provided by the app. Despite the growing unease, Angelo and Sarah pressed on, their curiosity overriding their trepidation. trepidation. The app directed them to a secluded area on the outskirts of town, far away from any signs of civilization. Sounds familiar? Yep. Um, the road was desolate, with only the faint glow of their headlights illuminating the way. A sense of isolated crept over isolation crept over them as they realized they were completely alone in the vast darkness. Unbeknownst to Angelo and Sarah, a notorious serial killer known as The Shadow had been stalking the area for months. It's creepy. So what if you're Sarah? Yeah, really. Like in this story, maybe you're Sarah. Mm -hmm. Preying on unsuspecting victims. He had developed a sick obsession with Randonautica. Yeah, sounds about right. Uh, using it as a twisted tool to lure and trap his victims. The fuck? As they parked the car near the designated coordinates, Angelo and Sarah got out and cautiously surveyed the surroundings. The air was thick with an eerie stillness broken only by... The distant howling of the wind. Suddenly a chill ran down their spine as they noticed a faint flickering of light in the distance. Intrigued and filled with a mixture of curiosity and fear, they decided to investigate. Guided by the flickering light, they ventured deeper into the dark, dense woods. Um, each step felt heavier than the last as they went, as they weaved through the gnarled trees and overgrown foliage. Sound familiar? Yeah. Um, Unbeknownst to them, the shadow was watching their every move. Hidden among the shadows, he, re he reveled in their vulnerability and felt the thrill of the hunt coursing through his veins. He had meticulously set the stage knowing they would fall right into his trap. Wow. Dude, it's, like, it's like the person that is the assailant writing about right? him coming after us. That is Suddenly, scary. Suddenly, Angelo's phone buzzed, indi indicating a new notification from Randonautica. Trembling with anticipation, he opened the app to find a chilling message. You've reached the end of your journey. Prepare to face your deepest fears. What the fuck? And it's weird, too, because I've had 
weird notification sometimes from random Nautica and then you click it and it just does nothing. Yeah. Before Angelo could react, the flickering light abruptly went out, plunging them into complete darkness. Panic set in as they realized they were now trapped in the clutches of a sadistic predator, as you mentioned, predators. Mm. Yeah. The woods echoed with the sounds of their terrified screams as they desperately tried to find their way back to safety. That literally just sounds like what happened. Mm -hmm. um, the shadow reveled in their fear, his presence felt but never seen. He taunted them, whispering menacing threats that seemed to come from every direction. The forest seemed to come alive with sadistic laughter, amplifying their terror. There's also Yikes. two cars coming in. That is wild. That is really weird. That's uh just be careful and continue with this. Um Miraculously, Angelo managed to find his way back to the car, battered and broken. Tears streamed down his face as he realized that Sarah was nowhere to be found. Trembling, he dialed the emergency surfaces, desperately praying for her safe return. Which is weird because, like, when I went in there, you you basically went missing mm -hmm. at one point. Like I had I no could not find you. I was looking yeah. for you. I was like, oh right. my god, like. This is um, not safe. So days turned into weeks and Angelo's nightmare persisted. Haunted by the memories of that dreadful night, Sarah was never found and the shadow continued his reign of terror, leaving a trail of victims in his wake. To this day, Angelo refuses to use random nautical or explore the unknown. The app serves as a chilling reminder of the horrors he encountered, a reminder of the night he was stalked by a serial killer, forever etched into his soul. Dude, wow. like, is that what just happened? Were we just like being followed by a serial killer yeah what the fuck? i've been having a similar thing because really? yeah it's and it i got jessica i got other names mentioned and i finally found this note and this note and this is what's going to be in next episode yeah. which i'm putting up so i also found this sorry to cut you off but yeah I no no this. it's cool there's an envelope that says hurt Okay. And then there's a weird card in here. I'm guessing it's some kind of weird card game that says, Tell a story about a time when something hurt. Wow. Isn't that weird? Yeah, that is weird. Like, what the? And then I have these random... I don't even know if this is from, like, a book. But... Little pages in. Yeah, it talks about David Copperfield. Like, it... They're nice and all. I'm not saying that, uh, saying that, but they're also touchy as hell besides i'm not going to tell you my whole goddamn autobiography or anything i'll just tell you about this mad madman stuff that happened to me around last christmas just before i got pretty run down and had to come out here and take it easy i mean that's all i told db about and he's my brother and all he's in hollywood this isn't too far from this crumbly crummy place blah blah blah, blah. what the hell yeah it's weird dude that is really weird um and it says something about this little kid that wouldn't let anybody look at his goldfish because he thought it was his own money. It killed me. Now he he's out in Hollywood, DB, being a prostitute. If there's one thing I hate, it's the movies. Don't even mention them to me. Like, what the? What does this even mean? Yeah, that's wild. I don't know. I don't know what to make of this stuff, but okay. I guess uh, best time to get the hell out of here. Mm-hmm. Right. For sure, man. Let's go. Okay.